Hi, I'm Jackie Castleman and I'm the Director of Academics here at Harrisburg School District. We are here today on Earth Day with some of our sixth graders who have the wonderful opportunity, as you can see, to plant some vegetables. Talk about a great way to support our community, to show them how they can help make this earth a better place. Today, they're planting all different kinds of, I'm told, greens, romaine, kale, chard, and they're going to water them, watching them grow, and then they will be transferred into a garden, which you'll hear more about. We are so excited for this opportunity because the fifth and sixth graders here at Camp Curtin have been involved in a program in collaboration with Penn State working on social and emotional skills, working on reflecting on themselves as part of the community. What a great way to celebrate Earth Day, doing something for themselves, which is also going to benefit the community. I am so proud of our students here at Camp Curtin. Today they're planting some lettuce, um, some kale, some Swiss chard. The fifth grade planted a lot of peppers. And then what we're doing is letting them watch the seeds grow in their classroom and, and start sprouting because we can't get them out into the ground yet because, you know, it snows in April. And then uh, we're planning field trips for them to go out to the YMCA Camp Curtain Garden, plant some plants, do some, they're also going to be... Um, are these all going to be edible plants, not beautiful, not beautification. So everything you mentioned... These are all edible. Ed right, everything yep. you mentioned is edible. But yep. with Rafika, is it also about beautification or no? Yeah, so we're also going to be doing some planters um, to put outside with, you know, nice planters with some yep. flower pots uh -huh. because that's something that Rafika said uh -huh. can definitely be used in there. They're going to be doing some painting some stepping stones and some of those little, like, kindness rocks yeah. too. Yeah. Uh, so we're going to be starting that actually next week um, and doing that for a couple weeks. And then we're going to be starting field trips out there so they can take what they've made for beautification and the, the um, edible plants okay. out there as well. Hello, Harrisburg School District. We are celebrating Earth Day right here in the Harrisburg School District at Cougar Academy, located at the Lincoln Administration Building. It's been an amazing experience with our students and our teachers. Next up, we're gonna hear from Ms. Cheryl Capazzoli and Mr. Rashad Macon to tell us how this project came together and what the scientific and environmental benefits are for our students. Um, basically, this project was to celebrate Mother Earth um, on this special day, Earth Day. Um, we also have been studying uh, bees and how honey bees are extremely important to our environment um, and that they are actually becoming very, very endangered. Um, the students learned about pollination, fertilization, and germination, and what a perfect timing it was that was set up that it fell right in line with Earth Day. So we came out and we greened our urban district so we planted three gardens this is the third one and we're hopeful that our flowers will bloom and um, bring back the pollinators that we need um, in our environment so it, it's a total stem activity um, environmentally safe activity and the students absolutely loved being part of it yeah this was a great idea that we were able to be involved with with uh, Ms. Capazzoli. Um, we have been talking in science about life cycles and, and we planted some sunflower seeds in our classroom. They're growing right by our windowsill. Uh, we water our plants every day or when they need it. Um, and we want to see how that goes. But Ms. Uh, Capazzoli had the, the idea for the seed balls. Um, and again, the timing worked out really good that it was Earth Day. And getting our, our younger students involved in Earth Day and, and the information that comes along with Earth Day um, so that our footprint is a little bit different when we grow up um, is something that's really important. Happy 